Why are the start positions always in front of enemies? Like, seriously. Like, I don't even have time to get my bearings. Crushed by a Cyclops. Okay. Ouch. Ouch. So this spawns me in a not so safe area, so I guess I'll have to fight my way out. Well, at least I had plenty of rockets. Okay, 100 health, no armor. This is going to be a bit tricky. Let's jump up, or I guess not. Okay, let's use cells. Okay, so there's nothing down here except for health. Okay, we can jump back up there. So I guess we're jumping up here. There's our way out. Okay, there's 15 monsters here. The title is Smell of Victory. Okay, eight more. All right, got some green armor. Oh, I missed that sound. I haven't heard that sound in a while. Takes four rockets to kill you. Now I want to try to get up there. Oh, there's no secrets to find in this level. Oh, the... <laughs> That's the lift. Oh, what the hell. Okay, so come back down, please. Come on. Come on. Come back down, please. I mean, seriously? You gonna come back down? Oh my god, seriously? Are you going to come back down at some point? Or was this just a one-time thing? Oh my god. Seriously? Level design is just so bad here. Alright. Goodbye, cruel world. There we go. Alright, so let's make our way up. Let's collect this stuff over here. And we'll just take the health kits over here. That was really stupid. Like, I was expecting the lift to just come back down after a while, but it didn't. All 
Alright, one rocket, two kills. I like that. All right, kill this guy, Kit. Somehow he can't see me. All right. Now this time, we're going to stay on the lift. I mean, we got armor down there. And then we meet this guy, like that arm, that green armor was just for this fight. Seems so weird. Oh well, it can go back down if I activate this switch. Alright, let's do this. Seven more enemies left. All you have are the death knight sounds. Should have just used the rocket launcher, damn. Oh, this looks like an arena. So you know what? Let's go ahead and save this. I don't know what to expect here. Whoa, so that did a lot of damage. Is this going to be the final boss? Is this really just going to be the final boss? Go shoddy. Somehow I get the feeling that there's supposed to be more than this. Let's try to like just damage him first. Wait a minute. Seriously? Seriously. Well, there goes my ammo. There goes all of my ammo. And, uh... That's it. So I just have health. So I'm taking... I'm guessing this is not how you're supposed to take on this boss. I need to try to get to that mega over there. In fact, there's two megas here. And what are these guys? Okay, where am I now? Uh... Ooh, we got buttons.
two different sounds for the butt to- That's how you kill him? Uh... <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. I mean, the end of, uh, Quake was something similar. You just had to telefrag, uh, the final boss at the end. But here, you press three buttons, and then the light just drops on him and kills him. I mean, what? <laughs> what is this? Okay, so... Let's read this. As Storm ground his boot heel into the skull of the corpse which had once led a dark wave of warmongering aliens to his beloved planet, he savored the sweet taste of vengeance fully realized. Whatever lay ahead of him now meant little, and the struggle he had survived was already blurring in his mind. Only one thing was certain. His crusade was over. I don't even know what's going on in the story, okay? Like, he ground his boot heel into the skull of the corpse. Like, no, I didn't. I dropped a light on him. <laughs> what is this game? Okay, it looks like this is it. Like, this is the end of the After, after the Fall mod for Quake 1. <laughs> so, wow, okay. I don't remember this. Because then again, I played this when I was like 12. It was, I think, 1998, I believe. Like, it was summer of 1998. And... That's when I played this, and I don't remember this being, like, this bad. Like, I don't remember the level design being so bad that I had to cheat just to get through it. Like, I don't know. This, it hasn't aged very well. That's what I'm trying to say in so many words. Like... I'm pretty sure this is why people focused on multiplayer at the time. It's like, it is so difficult to make a good single player game at the time. So people just made multiplayer. Uh, what else do I want to say? I guess that's it. Like, there's not a whole lot to say. I mean, this con- wait, congratulations? Is that how you spell congratulations? Pretty sure it's not. Well, anyway, that's all that is for After the Fall. That's all I have to say, really. I mean, this was made during a time when multiplayer was blowing up. It was huge. Everyone wanted multiplayer, so there was like very few people actually making single-player content. So I guess that's why this is so bad. It's like... Not many people know how to make a good single-player game, so this is what ended up happening. Anyway, I think I will end it here. Thank you everyone for watching. If you liked what you see, be sure to leave a comment, like, and subscribe for more stuff in the future. Please also check out my websites, esportsearnings.com and letsplayindex.com. The ad revenue from these videos goes towards supporting those projects. And that's all I have to say, so thank you everyone for watching, and I will see you in the next game, or perhaps the next mod.